Hey, what's going on, guys? How's your day going? I hope you had a good day and so far. I hope you had a good night, or depending on where you are right now. Um, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna take a look at the the bold N1 cameras, and uh, you know, just check them out in a little bit more detail. But um, make sure you guys stay locked in. Um, let's go over some of the specifications that we're getting on the cameras real quick. Um. All right, so on the Bold N1, we have the 13 megapixel pop-up selfie camera. If you hear that, it sounds really cool. And the 13 megapixel pop-up megapixel camera says you'll never miss out on the pop-up moments with the pop-up camera. It can be lifted up like 50,000 times without fail. Um, and then you have uh, the automatic descend feature where if it falls, you, you can make, it'll go automatically back into the phone, which is cool. And you can see that color on the back never gets old when it reflects perfectly, like in one spot. Um, you also do get an in display, in display fingerprint sensor as well. Um, 16 megapixel with a five depth sensor on the rear um, so it also supports portrait um, background HDR black backlight photography night scenes beauty mode uh, super pixel with a 96 super pixel super zoom feature um, so we're gonna test that out in this video so make sure you guys stay locked in with me it's your boy Serrano. Make sure you guys are hitting that, um, you know, that subscription and, and notification bell so you can subscribe and get notified uh, for more videos on the N1. Um, make sure you guys stay locked in with me. So the Bold N1 actually does have a nice premium design. It has like a really nice glass that, um, design with a heavy, like, you know, like premium weight to it. It's not too heavy, but definitely feels good um has a nice decent processor the helio p70 um has an in-display fingerprint sensor um it has a pop-up 13 megapixel selfie camera with ai technology and it does have that 60 megapixel camera with the 5 megapixel depth sensor now you can see here is the slow motion uh now tell me down below your honest opinion on uh, these few shots right here we're, that we're doing in slow motion and um, you know let me know how the quality is on this tell me what you think down below definitely think it came out pretty decent uh, this one here was kind of cool um, tell me if you see what on the screen what I see um, you know tell me down below uh, definitely looks really good quality though everything looks pretty good um, so these cams were definitely, you know, like, you know, they were pretty good for the price and everything like that. You're getting AI technology, the super zoom 96 megapixel, which we're going to go ahead and take a look at in a few seconds. Um, but make sure you guys stay locked in with me. Um, so this is the, you know, the front facing camera and that has the 13 megapixel on it. So you can see the detail is really good. Um, everything looks really crispy and everything so I didn't have any complaints about the, the front facing camera this is how it would look when you're holding the phone vertically like when you're normally holding it so it would be in this ratio but I just flipped that so it just looks a lot better when you know recording the video and everything but um, you can see right here um, we're getting we're definitely getting a lot of detail and um, you can see right here when you zoom in, it still retains, you know, some really good detail, which is definitely pretty sick. So um, I'm going to show you that 96 megapixel super zoom in just a second. But um, you can see right here, um, you know, the stabilization is pretty decent. Um, you know, it wasn't like the best one in the world, but, you know, it definitely was pretty good for the price. So this is how it would look when you're just taking a normal shot. But then when you turn on the super zoom with the 96 megapixel, that's how it would look right there. And then this is like a normal shot with the regular way. 
but then when you zoom it in you can see how it keeps the clarity on the detail which is definitely pretty sick and here's another example like right here and um let's just zoom that in and that's actually dope like tell me down below what you think i th definitely think that looks pretty cool though but um yeah the, this phone definitely takes some pretty decent shots in low light um and uh with the night mode which we're gonna get into in some more detail later on but right here like the portrait mode is um you could use some work but um you can see around my shoulders around my hair um it does lose a little bit of detail which isn't the best in the world but it could definitely use some improvement but right here like just when it's normal you're, you're getting some decent shots but um you know tell me down below what you think about the bold m1 cameras and um that pop-up selfie camera and um also the 13 megapixel with the 5 megapixel depth sensor but um it's your boy serrano make sure you guys stay locked in for more videos just like this uh you guys are the real mvps but in the meantime have a great morning afternoon evening and depending on where you are have a great night later